It's a tough result for NYCFC who extend their winless streak to five matches after a 2-2 draw today for Atlanta United. This is the first time the two teams played against each other since squaring off in the first round of the 2022 MLS Cup playoffs. But unlike last time when both teams were in the midst of a playoff run, Atlanta currently finds themselves outside the playoff picture, 11th place in the Eastern Conference. While New York City, they said fourth place in the East. This game started out slow with NYCFC having a ton of chances inside Atlanta's 18. They were just not able to get a finish until the 38th minute when Tati Castellanos got his first goal of the match, giving New York that 1-0 lead. But it wouldn't be hard for Atlanta to bring things back to even with the next goal coming from Joseph Martinez in the 56th minute. However, NYCFC, they responded immediately. Once again, Tati Castellanos scoring his 10th goal of the season, tying the lead for the Golden Booth and giving NYCFC that 2-1 lead. But fast forward to the 85th minute, NYCFC looks five minutes away from a huge three points in front of their home crowd, but a defensive lapse allowed Dom Dwyer to knock across into the back of neck and score the equalizer. That was it for a match, a disappointing one, 2-2 tie for the Pigeons. The biggest takeaway came down to New York on the offensive side of things, unable to provide themselves a crucial two-goal lead, which eventually would be the difference maker in this one. After the match, I asked head coach Nick Cushing about the team's struggles to finish on the offensive side. Hey, coach, it seemed like you were around the net, you know, all match long, 13 shots, only three on goal. You know, did you see anything on the offensive end that made it hard for you guys to finish chances? No, we had many opportunities, I think, in the first half of our press. We turned the ball over and we, we had opportunities to create. Um, we then got down the sides with Anton with Malta where we can put the ball in the box and we, we scored off that moment in the second half. But, yeah, I just think maybe we can we can create some cleaner chances, whether that's we're getting numbers in the box or finding the right, the last pass, finding the right person in the box. We can, we can be better at that, I think. And I think that's the disappointment, that when you get into those moments, like the area where you can put 13 shots on the goal, you know, we think we can get the two-goal cushion. And I think if we'd have got the two-goal cushion today, we'd have took the three points. Once again, NYCFC draws with Atlanta United 2-2. Their next match will come next Saturday, July 9th, first the New England Revolution. With WFUV Sports, I'm Michael Calamari.